pre-rotate, get out the shooters, run them off the line, and everybody else got to be ready to rotate to the next pass. I think the initial action we handled pretty decent the whole night. We just didn't get out. Shooters ran them off the line the uh, entire night, and they started making shots. And then some of those, I imagine, too, it's, it's a game of details. They got a couple deflections, and, you know, you know, your toe was on line for a couple of long twos that could have been threes. Right, so yeah. That's, that's the fine line. Yeah, definitely fine line with that. Uh, a lot of 50-50 balls we got to win. Um, you know, I think we got to do the little stuff better. We got to scream better. We got to uh, make the extra pass better. We got to, once they're double teaming Debo, we got to figure out uh, rotations that pre rotating over so we couldn't get the initial pass. So we got to find the open guy a little bit better. So uh, I think it's a lot of fixable stuff, a lot of little things, though, a little details. DJ, you didn't get off to the start that Dwayne wanted you to get off to. I mean, you give up a 30 point quarter, you're, you're outscored 30 to 18. That was something he stressed at the beginning, uh, at the end of practice today. What, what happened with the start? Uh, we gave a lot of open shots. We turned the ball over. They got easy baskets. Uh, there was a lot of wide open shots. I think, uh, you know, for us to win the series, we're going to have to run them off the line. They got so many shooters. We got to get guys off that line. Was it stuff in transition? Was it stuff off sets? What, what was it? I think it was a combination of everything. I think early on, we gave up almost everything. It was transition, it was spot up threes, uh, some bad fouls. I think we, we uh, just take care of the ball and get some shots up. I think a lot of possessions, empty possessions, we didn't get shots in the first quarter. So uh, every possession, we had to at least get a shot up. How do you how do you adjust that aggressiveness? I mean, they, they, they made more free throws than you guys attempted. I think we were aggressive. I think we had guys going in the lane. Uh, didn't get the same one, same calls, but you know, we got to play through it. We got to play through hits, try to go finish, uh, and keep attacking, make the referees make the calls, because I think our guys were attacking. Can you afford to get into a game? I mean, they, they like to play up-tempo. They like to shoot the three, and, and you guys do some of that. But can you afford to play that way consistently against them? Uh, uh, I don't think so. I don't think we, because uh, you get LeBron running on the break, he have to load up, and they got a bunch of 40% shooters running with him. Uh, so it's a little tougher. Um, I think if we can get them to play half-court sets, uh, half-court defense has been pretty solid all, all playoffs. So I think we got to slow down that break. They had 20 points on the break, so we got to slow that down and get back and get loaded up. This team plays with flair, especially when they're dropping shots. But do you take any exception to LeBron and the whole beer thing, him grabbing a beer? I didn't even see it, so no, I could care less. Been off, they've been off for about seven days. Were you surprised with the energy that they came out with early? No, they're at home. It's good energy in the gym. I think, uh, you know, they get a couple of those plays early, then they get their blood flowing. So that's, those are the plays we got to eliminate because I think once they get those, they start playing really hard together, <clears throat> moving the ball really well. So I think those are the ones we got to stop.